play and welcome in. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're not already. Oh. This is so random. I just like started not feeling good. I was gonna make um egg roll, uh, the steak and cheese egg rolls again with um steak and cheese empanadas. I'm like so upset. So I go grocery shopping yesterday. I get home and my empanada shells, the discos, I think that's what they're called, is all broken. So I'm like, what did this person do? Like put, you know, all the heavy meat in with the the freaking shells. I like can't even save them if I wanted to. And both packs are like this. I don't know if you guys can see, but every single one is cracked down the middle. And the same thing with this one. This one was actually busted open. Look at this. <laughs> I'm like, you know, you would think that when the people, the grocery store people, stock the shelves or the freezers, they would be looking for damaged items, but I guess not. Hello everybody, you guys can hit the like button on your way in, I would appreciate it. Yeah, so I don't like to buy the discos from um, Price Chopper, I don't know, they just, they're different there. So. I don't know. I'm going to go to Hannaford's tomorrow and see if they have any. And hopefully they do because I was really looking forward to making the steak and cheese empanadas. I was like, oh, those are going to be so bomb. Hey, babe. But I don't know. So we'll see. So I'm just going to make this chicken. Naya wants rice and broccoli. I'm not even going to eat, to be honest, because like I said, I do not feel good. Hey Summer, thank you guys for being here and hitting the like button. Hey Kelly. Uh, like I said, like I was about to, right before I went live, I just got like this don't feel good <laughs> feeling. I'm like, oh my lord. Alright, so let me share this out real quick. Create a post. Come cook. So tomorrow I will be doing the, um... The steak and cheese egg rolls, and I think Saturday for the live a thon, I'll try to do the um, empanadas. Venus, Venisi, Venisai, love your name. Lightweight jamming. <laughs> Alright, so let's put on some music so we can get this party started. Ugh. I hope this feeling goes away. I'm like hungry too. I just, you know when you don't feel good and it's like if you eat something you're afraid you'll get sick. Oh, no, I don't know. Alright. I was hoping she wanted macaroni and cheese because I wanted to make Denise Venise. Okay, beautiful. Thank you. I'm eating Cheetos. Are they the honey nut Cheerio kinds? Oh, Cheetos. Why am I picking the Cheerios? Never mind. <laughs> Scratch that. I'm um, like, is it the honey nut Cheerio kind? She's like, no, bitch. It's the cheese kind. What the fuck do you mean, honey nut Cheerios? Cheetos. Gotcha. Yeah, because I gotta use, I don't want this uh, pepper and onion to go bad. Yes, guys, I'm going to be making my um, Hypothon, Livathon flyer today. Don't forget, you guys, this Saturday is the Livathon. It's going to be dope. Marines and Army Mom. I think I know what you meant. 
yeah, you're like cheese, not Cheetos, not Cheerios, Cheetos. <laughs> so I'm good. Um, I'm just gonna make a few pieces of um, fried thighs. I'm making some white rice and I'm gonna make some broccoli. Like I said, I was gonna do the steak and cheese, um, egg rolls and empanadas, but all my shells are broke. So babe, you know how I got the um, the shells yesterday for the empanadas? Both packages are broke all the way in half. I'm like, how does that happen? Hey, Tashana. Okay. This oil almost ready. Oh my goodness. guys for hitting the like button i appreciate that hey rudy what i am cooking french onion soup with some shrimp al and broccoli oh wow do you have a channel because i want to see that hey mama four dmv here i come why who's in the dmv because we're in mass i'm pissed i don't ever need my id what? You have to go all the way to the DMV to get your thing. Wow. Hey, sissy. Mom of four boys. Thank you for coming over. I appreciate the support. That's crazy. Oh, I'm good. Thank you. Make sure your live is up to date, like up to speed, because when you get a call, it pauses the live. Let me see, I want to see. Let me see something real quick. You guys, I also posted, are you serious? You have to go all the way to the DMV from Cali just to get your license. Wow. They don't, they, they make stuff like hard for people you know what i'm saying it's like oh. yeah guys like i was saying i just posted a vlog earlier and the burt's bees deal is in there and the um laundry detergent and fabric softener deal is in there so please you guys if you need the products, go do it. This is a killer deal. 
and it's a dollar money maker. All you need is $14 and you get 15 back. You can't beat that, right? You cannot, where is it? What do I always say? You can't beat that with an egg beater. You cannot beat that with an egg beater. No, ma'am. Did I add too much water? I never mess rice up. I hope that rice isn't messed up. Usually doesn't bubble that much. Ugh. Riz, why? Babe, please stop telling people we know in real life. I like don't want nobody that I know in real life in my business, like at all. I can refer her to a couponing channel, but they I'm gonna kick your butt. Hey, juice, Jew, Jew. I was gonna say Jew, but then I was like, what if that's your man? So hello, JC family. Yes, 14 people watching. I've 11 likes. I'll take it. It's better than no likes, right? At least I'm getting the the watch hours. Yeah. Yeah, cause my mom, she was like curious about my channel. Look at this hair. She was curious about my channel. And um, I didn't tell her. I'm like, no mom. Like, I don't want you on the Riz. It was like, yeah. So I, he, she's telling, he's telling her about his channel. I'm um, looking at him, I'm like, do not tell her the name of it because then she'll see my comments and my name. And sometimes I come on here and vent. I talk about my life, what I've been through. And it's like, sometimes I, I don't want, you know, I don't want my family in my business, pretty much. Hey, Juice, I almost said PMC, but nope. I hope you had a good birthday. Uh, hopefully you got my birthday blessed and I sent, I sent you, I sent you a few bucks for your birthday. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Next week is Riz and I's anniversary and, um, Valentine's Day. It's crazy. Crazy. Time has gone by so fast. Yep, next week. Hey, forensic mystics. Yep. Yeah, so Riz had put um, Nightbot on his channel. I think I'm going to do a video. People are typing in my comments. I'm here. Come to the live. <laughs> Come to the live. So, what was I saying? Um, what was I just saying, guys? Hey, Elizabeth. Thank you guys for being here. I forgot what I was saying, but whatever. I can smell it too. What are you guys having for dinner? What are y'all having for dinner? And I still got the oil too. I'm saving that oil for the um the egg rolls. So I'm like, I only use it for the egg rolls, so I'm gonna save it, use it for the enchiladas. Okay. Oh, so yes, like I was saying, I'm going to be doing a video on the Nightbot, um, yes, so if you guys need help on any of that, it's literally so easy, once you get the hang of it, and you learn how to insert the commands, it's such a great tool to have, and you can also switch it so Nightbot doesn't time you out, and all that, you know how if you put like too many... <laughs> Well, Elizabeth, you better get to Walgreens because you got until Saturday to do the deal. Well, no, I think some of the coupons expire today. But, yeah. You guys, so you know how I dyed my hair? And the other day, my nails were, like, all 
this color, like maroonish. Can you believe somebody thought it was like all dirt? I'm like, bro, save your comments. It's not dirt. I dyed my hair and it's brown. <laughs> that would be crazy if somebody literally had dirty nails that bad and always in the food. Mm -mm. <sighs> yep. Yeah, Riz got, yeah, promotional offer already. A cl uh, not a collab, uh, what the heck's it called? I filed it. I ended up filing my nails and I just filed it off. But I kind of liked it because it was like my nails were dyed so I didn't have to paint them. I don't really paint them anyways. But I'm like, well, since people think it's like all dirt and crust. <laughs> I'm like, I wonder if, like, more than just that one person thinks that. <laughs> hey, Angie. Hope you're not working too hard. Hey, Joshua. I know. Dirty nails. Good boy, never. Said your mom was dirty, though. <laughs> oh, my gosh. My stomach is upset. I need some aqua. Why am I shaking this water like something's in it? Anyways. Alright, so after this, I'm getting back in my pajamas and I'm gonna just go lay on the couch until I feel better. Oh, you guys wanna see the plant I got yesterday? Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna show you guys. And I need some help because I don't want this plant to die. So I, don't, I know some of you guys know, I collect angels. I absolutely love angels, like the ceramic ones, the glass ones, like any knickknack. Hey Anisha, the rice is done. Look what I got yesterday. Isn't that so cute? I think it came with a little plant. So I need to, I need to know how to take this this plant out and how to replant it. You guys, I am not good at plants. Um, so yeah, is this aloe? What is this actually? Victorian cup, wait, what's a succulent? What's succulents? This is a succulent, right? This reminds me of a cat's tongue. If y'all ever looked at a cat's tongue, it has these little things. It's so gross. So I freaking do. Yes. Yeah, Angie. Let me show you guys real quick. Yes. I absolutely love angels. Hey, Carl. And I got that from my aunt. Um, my aunt loved angels, too. All right, hold on. So I got these ones. Why does that look so dusty? I got these two. I got the Precious Moments. This angel. You guys. You guys want to hear a story? You see this stuff in here? Yes, that's how I have to set up my thing. Don't come for me. Tell me why. I got this from... Um, what's it called? Burlington. Okay? <laughs> in a different town from me. Where I would say the crime is maybe a little bit higher than my town. <laughs> no studies. Okay. All right, uh, Juice, I'm going to have to get some info from you. All right, so I get this home, you guys, right? I'm, like, looking up this angel's, like, hole. <laughs> I'm like, oh, my God, there's drugs in here. I'm like, Anaya, there's drugs in my angel. Because she's seen it. She's like, Mommy, what is that? I said, oh, my God, I think it's drugs. I said, I don't know. Because all I've seen with this bag and this uh, green and white stuff in it. It's potpourri. This is for potpourri. It wasn't drugs. You guys, I was so creeped out. Thank you, Tuba Chat. I truly, truly, ex I feel like I'm pulling this tampon. <laughs> um, I was so, like, creeped out. I thought it was, yeah, a bag of dope. It was pretty crazy. But, yeah, I got this angel. Yeah, <laughs> okay. <laughs> this angel. And then the one I just bought. 
Look at my beautiful auntie. Rest in peace, auntie. We miss you. <sighs> yeah, so absolutely love angels. My aunt died. Um, but I just collect angels anyways. Um, so that stand I have is like a little memorial. I have Hey Tay. I have my grandfather's stuff, my cousin's stuff, my aunt right next to my cousin, which was her daughter, my dad's stuff, and I kind of just collect angels, and I have angels all around them. I got the flags around them. Um, yeah, it's okay. It's all right. But yes, um, you know, it's, it's life. But... I try, so with family members that pass, you guys, this is just something I do. I don't know if maybe you guys want to do it if you're having a hard time. But I leave their pictures out. Um, like I said, I have a little memorial and I leave their pictures out so I see it all the time. Because, so I had came across a... Uh, picture of my cousin and this was before I did my memorial and it caught me off guard like so much it was I I just felt like pain all over again so I said I'm gonna put pictures of my loved ones out on a little um like memory thing for them so I see them every day so if I do come across their pictures it doesn't hit me like damn you know so Seeing them every day has helped me grieve, um, and it just, like, it gives me, like, motivation. Like, I'm gonna, you know, be the best version of myself. I'm gonna make this person proud or that person proud, you know. Yeah, Joshua, I absolutely love them, too. And, um, like, I wanted to get a tattoo... But I don't necessarily want an angel. I want like the angel wings. And maybe a halo. I don't know. Right. Okay. Naya came home hungry. So she made um, toast with peanut butter and bananas. I'm like, yeah, that's good. Mommy likes that too. If you want some, no. <laughs> no, thank you. Oh crap, I'm deep in the water. Dang it. chicken bouillon or chicken stock flavor because if you have white rice and instead of adding water add like chicken broth or um the bouillon cubes it is a game changer yes happy birthday to pmc it was his birthday the 7th Thank you for dropping links. You guys got any plans for this weekend? 
I'm putting on. You guys, Riz and I are going to be doing, hey Tracy, I'm glad you're here. Um, Riz and I are going to be doing this thing called On The Rocks. Have you guys heard of it? It's called On The Rocks. So if you guys don't know what it is, you BYOB, that's booze, not bowl. <laughs> Usually it's bowl, not booze. So you bring your own like liquor, wine, whatever. And it's a group of people. And one person teaches you how to paint. And everybody paints the same thing. And your painting comes out like looking like so professional. And you can have a little drink, paint. It's going to be a vibe, you guys. I'm going to record there. Well, I'm going to ask, you know. So... I'm really looking forward to it. I have to get a little bit more details, but it doesn't even really matter how much it costs because we're doing it no matter what. Um, this week we have both the kids this weekend. Um, next weekend I think Maya will be going to my mom's house to this class overnight. And we're probably going to do it maybe next weekend or the weekend after but I figured it would be fun and um, you know just something nice to do has anybody in the chat done that before I want to make sure I'm not missing nobody peach pizza for lunch what kinds mm -hmm. yeah I think I got everybody Christy. never done it yeah so you guys ever seen the pictures <clears throat> and it'll be like people holding up a picture and it's like the same exact one they did um one was like this sunset and they did like bob ross paintings i'm talking about like the snow on the trees and the trees all in the mountain i was like oh shit <laughs> i kind of believe it oh like that looks so professional hey kimmy a girl so yeah i'm definitely looking forward to that in phoenix yeah angie right the pictures come out like looking so good and it's it's crazy um i had seen the people that were painting you know in the window and everybody's picture looks so freaking good i was like oh my goodness I'm so upset that all my my empanada shells were broken like that. I was really looking forward to making those today. Maybe I'll take a walk up to the, the food truck. It's like 50 degrees. Alright, bye Jules. Are you serious, Angie? Oh my god. That is funny. Jules, you going live tonight? yeah i want to do it yeah so it's called on the rocks it's gonna be so much fun the moonshine the moonshine was bomb half gone bomb <laughs> the watermelon is so good i had it when i was doing the um my giveaway a few days ago all right i can't wait it is nice Oh, tomorrow? Okay. I was thinking you were going to go live yesterday, but you didn't. Alrighty. I was watching this um this chef's live 
And you know what he did? He had raw broccoli, you know, like from the grocery store proto -style. He took a clean, um, or it can be a paper towel. Wait, did he wet the broccoli? Yes, he wet the broccoli. He wrapped it in a towel, put it in the microwave for 30 seconds, and it came out, and it was completely steamed perfectly. Mm. All right, Carl, have a good night. I'm looking forward to my taxes. I wanna do something for myself for once, since I'm always carrying for baby daddy and baby. Yes, girl, yes. Do something for yourself, you deserve it. Are you guys getting a good amount back? Yeah, you should do something, do something together. Or um, do you have a great wolf around you? The Great Wolf Lodge? That's always fun. It was so nice. We all we used to go there all the freaking time before the pandemic. And um, so we would go, the kids would be playing. And I found out they sold um, mixed drinks inside of the pool. <laughs> so Riz and I got a drink and we're just like sitting, the water's hitting our feet, the kids are playing. It was fun. Great Wolf is definitely a good place to take the kids. Alright. You guys want some ASMR? I'm out of bags. That's why it is so nice to keep on you guys. I can just walk into my closet, aka my store, and get some balls. How lovely. Oh my goodness, Andrew. Oh. Okay, Kimmy, well shoot. Forget forget I mentioned baby daddy and baby. You do something for yourself. Alright, JC Kim, thank you. Oh, that's cool. I really like Polari. I never heard of that. Yeah, tires are so freaking expensive, Angie. Especially, did you get like all season or are they winter? Yeah, you guys, don't forget. Um, if you got the <clears throat> the child's credit. Um, throughout the year, you know, that check we were getting once a month, just remember that's part of your tax money. So your taxes will not be that much if you, if you told them you want that check every month last year. Just keep that in mind. like oh yeah oh wow yeah <laughs> and, uh, okay. yeah that's the thing it like like all right so when i was when i got my first car i think it was a chevy cavalier or was it a ford i don't remember anyways i didn't know <laughs> like you live and you learn you right my stomach is so upset. So, hold on. So I needed brakes. 
but I um I was like, oh, I'll do the brakes later. I would like when my car would stop, it would grind. Well, like two months after needing brakes, um, two months after needing brakes, I brought it to the shop. No, I don't feel better. I brought it to the shop finally, and then I needed rotors. Well, you wore your brakes down so much that it affected the rotors. So where it could have been like an $80 fix turned into almost 400 And so I'm like, I will never not keep up with the car again. Hey, Sammy Joe, I'm so glad you're here. Oh, you're baking? What are you making, girl? Thank you for swinging by. I know that's why I asked you today. I'm like, are we connected? Because I think I've seen you like maybe once or a few times before, but I couldn't remember. Let me try putting this up a little bit more. Ugh. Thank you guys for being here and hitting the like button. I truly appreciate everybody that hits that like or dislike button and um, my mods and members, of course. I know everybody's busy, but I definitely miss a couple of my mods that I haven't seen that much. You know, it stinks when, you, when you're used to seeing, when you like see somebody all the time or like, you know, like four or five days out the week and then you don't see them as much. It's like you suck it, you miss them, you know? Okay. Okay. Let, let the grease cool down. Oh, you put the Nita. Yes, I was referring. Shanita is definitely one of them that I was talking about. There's a few. There's like two or three. All right, Carl. Good night. You guys, tomorrow Carl is having a stream at 3.30 p.m. Eastern Time. Everybody's busy and they got their own crap going on, so yeah. Yep. Apple Chris. Yeah, definitely won't be inside bacon, right? 3 p.m. Eastern time, okay. 3 p.m. 3 p.m. watching a scary movie earlier see like okay so Riz wants to put on the other night he wants to like 10 o'clock at night right no it was like nine he wants to put on this like zombie movie where these people turn into parasites I was so scared <laughs> so I watched a scary movie today during the day it was so weird I don't get, like, how do they make up some of these movies? I do not get that. Like, where do they get this idea? Yet New York. The Parasite movie, it's on HBO. I forget what it's called. Mountains are beautiful. Beautiful view. Last of Us. Parasites. Something that I'll never have. Something that she might 
the butter over here. <clears throat> Naya! Baby, don't you Naya. Melt butter, melt. I don't put, after I drain the broccoli, I don't put it back on the stove because then it just makes it watery. Are you going to eat right now? All right, I'm going to get your plate together. You guys, I did buy some of the um, shake and bake. Your pleasure recommended it. I hope it comes out good. Okay, look at that chicken. Look at that chicken. Look at that chicken. That didn't get me. Baby, that was close. In my Nick, Nick the Great podcast voice. Baby, that was close. Do you have a drink? Glad I checked because one of them isn't done all the way. All right, Peanut, here. Rookie mistake. And that perfect little ball just crumbled. I'm going to have to get chives again. chicken if you want it. This is like probably a few more minutes. Almost done. Okay. Not trying to kill nobody with some salmonella. Hey HT. I want to go back when it's warmer. Yeah. Yeah, uh, Great Wolf is close to us, too. Oh, really? That's cool. That's cool. 
Does your mom know you pop pop pass? <laughs> your mom's gonna come and <laughs> she's kind of <laughs> momming. <laughs> What are you and the missus having for dinner? the live as I'm live like this on the, the device I'm recording on because like last time I lost the um <laughs> the butter cover you guys I did not find it for a little while it was like a couple days I ended up using the tin foil and then I found it in the drawer I was like oh shit, that's where my cover went hey Rooks Hey Shorty, I haven't seen you in a while, girl. How you doing? I am making some chicken. I made rice and broccoli. <clears throat> I'm just finishing up this piece of chicken and then I'm gonna put it all away. How you doing? I'm good. That's okay. Thank you for um Whatever she puts up on me. Thanks for swinging by. All right, Tracy, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. Yep. Like I said, this chicken has maybe a minute basically done you guys what would you do right if you're like hosting dinner and somebody gets a uh, like almost like a little bit of raw pink in their chicken. What would you guys do? What would you do if you were eating at somebody's house and it happened to you? Like somebody gave you the food that was halfway done and what would you do if you were cooking for somebody and gave them the food that was halfway done? Would you just act like it's, it didn't happen? Would you, <laughs> what would you do? Okay, perfect. I definitely don't want it dry. So they got this one. Thank goodness. Oh, hot. that 
cool down. Mmm, very flavorful. I'm gonna start making my um homemade sofrito like I used to. You guys, if you don't know what sofrito is, it makes such a big difference in cooking. Hey, Tamika. I see you just coming, girl. y'all's answers. I want to see what you would do. <laughs> that would be embarrassing. I would feel so like, embarrassed. Especially if I was hosting like Christmas or something and that happened. <laughs> like, alright y'all, we're ordering Chinese food. <laughs> How did your um audition audition go yesterday? You had it on the eighth, right? Hey GJ, thank you for being here. <laughs> it's a nice story. Just say it like that too. <laughs> How are my food cooked? Oh, you just got off work. Which, what time did you go in this morning? I want my food cooked and I want it cooked now. Hello, DJ. Hello. Alvin, how did your audition go for the voice? It was the voice, right? <laughs> well, GJ is in a good mood. Don't you wish like life was just that easy? Singing and dancing. Yes, the eighth Alvin, I remember. How did it go? Are you moving on to the next step? Did they say, mm, cut? What happened? I'm a firm believer in temps on me. Yeah, okay. Yeah, maybe I should start using my, um, cause I do have the thermometers. I just usually cook it for a while and then like when it looks cooked I'll check it I don't know why I didn't just check it a second ago but that would have saved me five minutes you guys got any plans today or just chilling just chilling chilling let me see something I read that wrong on the calendar. I was like, what? 165. And is that any um, part of the chicken? Excuse me. So could that be like leg, thigh, anything like that? Because it's weird. <clears throat> on this one that I have, it shows the chicken to be done at 190. 195. <clears throat> Cause this like has the meat it's so if it's a cow it should be done at like 160 what is that if it's a is that a lamb what kind of animal is that is that a baby cow or is that a lamb and why does that one look like a cat this one looks like a freaking cat okay it even has a tail <laughs> and no ma'am the pork should be done at 190 and 
I think it says like 200 for the chicken. So yeah, I will start using this one because it says beef and lamb 160, poultry 165. Good to know. That's what I will start doing. <laughs> no meow here. <laughs> no thank you. What do you think about all of them? Verts. That I always Santana was talking about. By the way, real quick. Oh, today. Today, GJ. Um, that's freaking crazy. Literally watching her thing and her telling us about all the research she did literally had me second guessing if I'm a psychopath or not. <laughs> I was like, am I a narcissist? <laughs> but yeah, <clears throat> always Tam Tam goes live every day, um, Monday through Friday, I should say, not every day. 6.15, mostly on the dot. <clears throat> um, and she just has great information. She researches all the topics she talks about. She relates to them and she's telling us about like certain traits and think just things about like yourself <clears throat> that <laughs> literally had me questioning. And I'm like, that is so interesting. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> right, HT? <laughs> I'm about to make some barbecue turkey wings. Oh, that sounds good. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go outside and go for a walk. Maybe some fresh air will help me. I don't know. My stomach is just like upset. <clears throat> yeah, and you guys, <clears throat> if you do cook something that is bomb or not bomb, tag Riz and I in it. I love when you guys tag me and stuff, and I don't know. I just love it. I got tagged like three times today and it was it was random and like the stuff that they cooked I was like thank you so much for tagging me in that that looks bomb did you tag me just to make me hungry or are you gonna actually share that's the question <laughs> mm -hmm. that does sound good <clears throat> I even know you get that. But like I said, thank you so much, you guys, for spending this hour with me. I will be live tomorrow. Same time, same place. Probably same time. Um, yeah, so tomorrow I'm definitely going to do this steak and cheese egg rolls. And then I am thinking about Saturday. Like I said, I'm doing the live-a-thon. And I need something to cook. So I am going to make a community post and uh, if you guys don't mind, drop some ideas for me. And yeah, so I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you so much to everybody that hit the like button. My mods, members, freaking love you. Okay, nobody's a suspect. Alright, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Love you guys.